What's good? What's good? Tired, exhausted, man. Just came back from the gym. I did a uh, what we like to call a two a day. I did one of those. So I'm tired, man. Shalom, Jacob. Man, I am beat. So, in the midst of being tired and exhausted, I want to promote uh, family time, you know, I, and how important it is. I ain't going to be on long. I'm too tired, man. I want to hop on the video game and doze off. That's what I want to do. But let me see if you, they can see you. They can see you. All right. But, uh, yeah. The importance of family time, especially, man, when you're trying to uh, deliver them something spiritual. Uh, like, you know, the law. We're trying to get the, get our kids more involved with the law. So we need to... Uh, this girl, she's full of everything. Come on, play with this. Play with my water bottle. So, you know what I'm saying? Like trying to get our kids more in tune with the law. I think it's good that, you know, we spend just regular time with them. Uh, you know, whatever it may be, play the game with them, you know, watch TV with them and just, you know, and talk to them in the midst of that. And that and that's a good teaching tool, too. So they know whatever whatever uh, situation they in, they know that the most high is in that situation. So, you know, when I talk to them man, I talk to them about the most high in any situation. You know, I make it about the game. Like, for example, my kids play Minecraft. So when we when we when I'm watching when we kid, kicking it playing Minecraft, you know, uh, it's a scenario where you know you get hungry, and uh, you have to go eat. So, and sometimes you're telling people bye bye, and sometimes you know you got to go look for some food like a a cow or 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 whatnot. Hold on, what I do? Lost my phone. Lost my phone. But anyway, yeah. So you know, it's a scenario where you know you and uh, so they may go look for a cow or a sheep or whatever the case, and and then you know they got pigs on there, they got horses, so they know they know not to eat the pig on the game. I mean, even on the game on a Minecraft, they don't even eat the pig. So and that's just me showing them the laws and everything they do so even on the video game they're keeping the laws as their character so it's just not so i'm making it where it's not something they could, they just doing you know for play play you know this ain't something that mommy and daddy just want you to do every once in a while this is who you is this is how you got to conduct yourself for the rest of your life young queen man she looks just like me so <laughs> yeah it's all good indeed jacob indeed yeah, it's a little, it's a little, it's a little mama. She look just like me. I said it too. She do look like a boy. She look like a boy, but she's a girly girl. She's a girly girl. A girly girl, girl. Look at you, girly. Look at you, girly. Look at you, girly. Yeah. Oh no, it's all good, bro. And I'm just, I was uh, just talking about like, you know, even with my kids, with family time, you know, I'm not substituting nothing in place of the law or, or, or the commandments. So even we play the game, I mentioned Minecraft, when my kids play the game, they know not to eat the pig when they need some food on the game for their character. They know not to eat the pig or the horse. You know what I'm saying? And, and certain things they just won't do. You know, they be like, that's not in the law. We can't, we can't, you know what I'm saying? So it's, it's in them to do this type of stuff. Uh, regardless of you know whatever they whatever they playing. Now of course if you playing a shooting game, I mean, you know you gotta have some some type of uh, uh, you know I mean or not let let your kids to play uh, uh, allow your kids to play shooting games. Oh. We play shooting games. We play Call of Duty. We play Fortnite. Um, what else? Anything we get our hands on, man. You know, but in that time, you know, something is coming up. We'll be dealing with the most high. And especially them trying to be fair with each other. I teach them all. I promote this to them all the time. Y'all make sure y'all treat each other fairly. Y'all make sure y'all doing righteous judgments with each other. So they will always come to me and like, hey, dad, it's fair. 
is, is this, you know, is this uttermost eye, you know what I'm saying, to make sure that they are in line with each other when they deal with stuff. So, you know, we find ways, man, to uh, incorporate the law in every in every situation. What? So me and me and little mama gonna kick it for a while. So I ain't gonna hold y'all too long. But I do want to promote family time, man. And, and it ain't no substitution for the law. Girl, they can hear you. Can I can I say a few things? Huh? <laughs> you know, man, we be getting a lot of moths too around the house. I gotta close these windows tighter or something. But I think once they lay some eggs in here, you forever got them. Unless you get the exterminator. Judy, come on. So, baby, that's all that's all I wanted to chop it up about, man. Appreciate that. Yeah, she wanted she wanted to kick it. She wanted to play. I know. All right, well, tell everybody. <laughs> tell everybody bye-bye then. Tell them bye-bye. Say bye-bye. No, say bye-bye. Say bye bye. Say bye bye. Yay, say bye bye. <laughs> blessings, bro. Blessings, man. I ain't gonna hold y'all. So, yeah, man, just promoting family time. And you can find a way to talk about the most high anything. I mean, that's what I do. All right, Judy, we out. All right, y'all. I'm gonna catch y'all tomorrow. All right, we gone. We gone. We gone. All right, we out of here. We gone. It's the end.